Hello everyone, welcome to this step-by-step -step guide on deploying Magento open source on Azure using single-click on template. If you are looking to host a flexible e-commerce platform on Azure with seamless integration, you have come to the right place. Let's dive in. Magento Open Source is a free and highly adaptable e-commerce platform, ideal for creating and managing online stores. In this tutorial, we will use an Azure Resource Manager template to deploy Magento on Azure, integrating with various Azure services like Kubernetes, Entry-ID, and Azure MySQL. This setup optimizes performance, scalability, and security for your online store. Our run template utilizes key Azure services, including Kubernetes, for containerized Magento deployments, Azure Database for MySQL as the backend, Redis Cache for session management. Azure CDN for delivering static content, and much more. These components ensure high availability and performance for your Magento sites. To deploy Magento with this ARM template, follow these steps. In your Azure subscription, create an e-resource group where all the Magento resources will be deployed. To create an e-resource group, click Create. Once the wizard is open, select your subscription and then type your resource group name and then select the region as close as possible to your location. This resource group will then be used for our Magento application deployment process. Then, obtain public and private keys from the Adobe e-commerce marketplace for secure access to Magento source files. To create authentication keys, visit the e-commerce marketplace and then click to sign in. If you don't have an account, click register. Once you are registered, then click account name in the top right of the page and then select My Profile. Then click Access Keys. Click Create a new access key, enter a specific name for the keys, and click OK. New public and private keys are now associated with your account that you can click to copy. Save this information or keep the page open when working with your project. We will use the public key as username and then private key as password later on. Next, we will configure permissions by creating a role with specific assignments. Use Azure CLI commands to set up access for Kubernetes, CDN profile, and virtual machine contributions, which are essential for deployment processes. Before running these commands, you'll need to identify your subscription ID and resource group name. Once you prepare your CLI commands, then run the following command on Azure CLI to create a role and assign necessary permissions for running the automated script to configure AKS. Save the app ID and password from the first Azure CLI command as you need to provide this information to the template when deploying in later steps, filling required information in ARM deployment. Now, it is time to deploy. Now you can log into your Azure account and start customizing the deployment settings. To continue, you can use the Deploy to Azure button for one-click setup. In the deployment form, select your subscription first and then resource details. Your region will be automatically retrieved based on your resource group. Then paste the app ID and password that you created before. Credentials from your Adobe's repository will be used in the following fields. Then you need to type your Magento admin password that you need to be used for later on. Configure optional components like Redis Cache and others based on your needs. To secure your site with HTTPS, you can create your key vault in the resource group that import your SSL TLS certificates. This ensures encrypted connections, protecting your users' data and enhancing the trust. If you are going to use SSL encryption for users to reach the Magento e-commerce site via HTTPS, then once your certificate is important, make sure turn on SSL TLS and Azure CDN fields in the deployment templates. And do not forget to put the key vault and the certificate names as well. To finish the process, Configure storage account name. The deployment setup comes with default name, but you can change it based on your needs. And then write your virtual machine admin password and your admin email as well. Once complete, hit create to start the deployment. Azure will now validate the template and you can monitor progress right from the Azure portal. Great, our deployment has started. The ARM template will create and deploy the following resources in the Azure account. The deployment includes creating a virtual machine to assist in setting up the AKS cluster and CDN endpoints. 
after deployment completes, go to resource group and open the AKS cluster and check the workloads. Look for Magento Server and cron jobs and ensure everything is up and running. Finally, go to the services and locate the external IP from your AKS cluster services. Enter this address in your web browser. And congratulations, your fully functional Magento e-commerce site is live and ready to serve customers. All thanks to the power of Azure. To reach the admin panel, type admin at the end of the URL and log in as admin that you type during the deployment and then write your password to log in the admin panel. Congratulations, you have successfully deployed Magento open source e-commerce platform. And there you have it, a seamless Magento deployment on Azure in just a few steps. Thanks to the Azure integration with Magento, your e-commerce platform is now scalable, secure, and ready to grow. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more Azure MySQL deployment tutorials. See you next time.